Welcome to this channel. So yesterday, there is a Wing Chun friend who asked me, are there a Man Sao in 1850s Wing Chun? So today, I'd like to share with you in details. And uh, also, this video will uh, clarify many things for uh, those who is not in Wing Chun but interested to learn the ancient traditional Chinese martial arts. Now, if we go to the YouTube and Google the Wing Chun Man Sao of 1960s, Man Sao in general is named as Asking Ham. So in the movie, you always can see the Man Sao is putting out this way. Some in the YouTube, when they teach the 1960s Man Sao, will say it is a concept, it is not a technique. And uh, it is like antenna. And uh, <clears throat> it is to get contact so that uh, you can stick at your opponent. And uh, some say it is a pre-fighting uh, posture. And you can see that the hand is uh, usually in a static way and some can uh, have their uh, variations or doing all kinds of uh, different techniques. There's Man Sao. And the most usual thing is like uh, you see is static, you put it up there, it is like uh, in pre-fighting position. This is what the reality of 1960s Wing Chun. <clears throat> in <clears throat> 1850s Wing Chun, that is no Man Sao like that. The fighting posture of 1850s Wing Chun is this, not this, okay? So, it is, uh, give me one second. It is this, because it is a short strike art based on Shaolin. You need to contract, okay? And then that is for your mobility, for your variations and change. And then only when you strike, you uh, uh, put out your, your, your hand, okay? Or you strike out or extend and then you have to come back again, okay? That, so it is in uh, uh, Restricting Wing Chun, all the teaching of the Shaolin, you need to handle that, okay? So it never is put the hand out like that, out there or anywhere to asking or those kind of concept. 1850s have something which is not seen in the 1960s and that is the momentum probe momentum probe because in 1850 it is not interested on the hand how to play with the hand or stick with the hand it is interested in momentum so probing momentum probing momentum is the bottom line in the 1850s uh, quote-unquote uh, Man Sao, asking hand. It is probing momentum instead of asking other people's hand or dealing with this hand. It is probing the momentum. And this probing momentum, it is a dynamic and transient stuff. 
it happened really fast like probing you just send your probe up and you probe okay not you put your hand up there or different way or, or put the posture it's not like that now this concept of momentum probing it is inherit from Ming Dynasty okay Ming Dynasty in the Ming Dynasty be it General Qi Qi Guang's uh, military classic or Tang Sun Zi military classic it has this momentum probing it's called the Tan Ma probing the horse probing the horse it's like you send your horse out you probe your, uh, the, the, the army okay so in the uh, restricting Wing Chun I share with you that this is the uh, probing the momentum probing <coughs> or Tan Ma probing horse okay and uh, this concept this uh, this this concept this type of techniques is uh, inherit later in the uh, Shaolin sword strike so so in Ming Dynasty you have this probing uh, momentum or momentum probing this uh, this this uh, this this tools we're gonna use it as the, the name as tools this is one of the element of the traditional Chinese martial arts to probe okay now so what is this probing momentum is for is for probing is for feint Fainting is for setup, is for attack, is for close in. And I'm going to uh, uh, how do you say that? Explain you uh, further. Technically, the tools you want to use for this momentum probing, they have to be a long distance tools, long distance. They has to be lightweight. It has to be fast, be able to be fast and mobile. Okay, so that is the, uh, the, the, the criteria needed for the techniques to implement the momentum probing. Okay, now, so you say, well, you know, Hendrik, so uh, is there any records? Yes. This is writing clearly. How is it uh, the probing uh, actually works or integrate together with short strike art? Okay, so it is this one. Okay, now in the Wing Chun, what it is? Well, I'm going to share with you later because Wing Chun have its uniqueness way. Okay, now, so if you can look at this probing, this momentum probing, like what, like today's Western boxing's jab. Okay, like like today's Western boxing jab. You can use the probing hand to probe. To test the water of your opponent, you can feign and then you attack. Or if you probe him and if he is not aware or he is too late or he is he cannot handle it, okay, or it is it's a blind spot, you go direct in attack. And also the probing is for close in. For close in. So, so it is not, uh, I invented this thing. It is written or in the Chi Chi Guang classic. It is written here on this probing and attack and uh, all the change of, uh, of handling momentum. 
this thing is written here. Okay, now. So, so, so you know that you think about it today as a, a, a Western boxing jack. Very fast, very mobile Western boxing jack. Okay, it can set you up, it can feign, but it can, it can, it can hit you too. Okay, but Western boxing never get close, right? Because it's a long fist art. It is not like like the uh, short strike uh, of Shaolin or Wing Chun or the Ming Dynasty, uh, Dynasty short strike because it's a different type of art, right? There's nothing wrong with the Western boxing because they have their uniqueness and the traditional Chinese martial have their uniqueness. But the concept is the momentum probing and the pre-fight position is always, the guarding position is always like that. As I share just now, you know, you can see in the restricting Wing Chun. Now, if you look at in the, uh, in the, uh, uh, the, the, the general Chi Chi Guang classic, it show you that, it show you that, let me share with you the bigger picture. It is like a fist, right? So this is probing momentum. The guy has to be uh, not just moving his hand, the, the entire body, okay? Like when you do a jab, you do not just you are not just moving your arm for 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 asking arm. No, you your body go there, and in the Ming Dynasty, this is General Qi Qi Guang or Tang Sun Zi time. It used a punch, okay, and Guess what? Later in traditional Chinese martial art, you can see if it can be a punch, it can be a pilji this way or pilji this type of thing. Okay, of a finger probing type of thing. Okay? Wing Chun. Because it is based on uh, er mei, on another hand, is using short finger. Because short finger is lightweight. When you go, you are lightweight and you can change. Okay? So, let me share with you this. In the Restricting Wing Chun, this is the Wing Chun probing hand. That's why if you read it here, the descriptions if you read it here it says finally a uniqueness of sword finger is light and agile thus sword finger often being used as a tool in wrong range to probe the opponent's reaction. So this is the probing hand. This is the Wing Chun salutations and this is the probing hand. Okay, so in to answer the question, does uh, 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 Wing Chun have Man Sao in 1850? That salutation is Wing Chun Man Sao. And I like to share with you this. This is the Wing Chun 1850 momentum probing with the short finger. This is General Chi Chi Guang's probing horse. You see? So, this is what it is. Okay? So, 1850's Wing Chun, we have massive, massive data can prove that it link up to, uh, uh, to Shaolin, to uh, to uh, uh, Qi Ji Guang, to Tang Sun Zhi. In fact, I can show you this. Just give me one second. Yeah, 
from my new book, the Kung Fu uh, Sauce Code. This is the Shaolin. It said that this is Shaolin Salt Strike. This is the General Chi Chi Kuang. And this is the General Chang Sun Zi's writing on the momentum probing. Okay? So, hopefully this clear many things for you. Okay? In Tang Dynasty, uh, sorry, in Ming Dynasty, 460 years ago, it's like this, and I probe you. Okay, this is Wing Chun, which is later, you know, after uh, it evolved to the uh, Shaolin Sword Strike, and then the, the uh, what do you call it, the, uh, the Ermei, and get into the Red Boat, it become the Wing Chun, using the Ermei uh, Sword Finger, because it is agile, lightweight, mobile and go for a long distance really fast and be able to change the body and in the Ming Dynasty is a fist or usually you can see it with the uh, with the uh, with the uh, palm not not palm finger strike for probing okay so in today's thinking it is like a western boxing jab of course your body has to move so it is not it is very different than the 1960s uh, Wing Chun. When, uh, like in the movie, you put out there Wing Chun, you always put the hand like that. It, it is not like that. Okay? So it is not like Ting Hao when they fight Xi Xiao Dong, it is put your hand like that out and then put this thing. No. It is this. It is compressed and uh, contract. It's ready to explode out. And once a while using the probing to set up to feign uh, to attack and so you ask me the last thing so Hendrik how to get close in well when the probing hand uh, Combine with the circle hand. You probe, you circle, you in. Which is the hin sao. You probe, you lap, you in. So probing hand, when it integrates with the hin sao, you probe. Okay, so if I, if I probe you this way, okay, if I probe you this way, Say you are coming from here, I can do Hyun and then come in. Or, if, you, if your hand is outside here, okay? So just make it more clear. If I probe you, if your hand is here, I can do a Hyun Sao here and go in. If I probe you, your hand is here, I just do a lap and then go in, okay? If I probe you, your hand is not there, and you attack me, I'm gonna kick you and get in okay that is how the an example for you so hopefully this clear out everything no traditional chinese martial art is not like the ex traditional chinese martial art which i mentioned yesterday in the uh, in uh, my other youtube on uh, the mass of uh, traditional chinese martial art in modern china it is really pragmatic it is using in war and it using in the war is not like today many people saying that oh Chi Chi Kuang army they just go straight they go straight no the 32 this 32 momentum handling or momentum handling Every momentum within the momentum have a change. There are many changes in, uh, in, in, in one momentum. It's the proof to, 
tell all those who say keeping saying, oh, Chi Ji Guang is only go a spear in straight line uh, because it's military. No, that's not the case. Okay, like the other day I shared with you on the uh, the 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 the, the Chi Ji Guang sword. It is not a straight in stuff. It's a lot of angling, a lot of momentum. So, uh, 460 years ago, traditional Chinese martial art is already really mature art. And for our uh, ex-traditional Chinese martial art today, you see how many people know this? <laughs>